Good morning, everyone. 10.15 a.m. This is Francis. Remember me? I'm your favorite amateur astronomer. We're taking on UCO12714. An unidentified celestial object. Presented to us by a... YouTube user who reported coordinates for a particular object for a particular reason. I can only assume the reason is for someone to go out and take pictures, which I did. Here's the first run of images of the space where UCO12714 should be. Let's see what we found. Okay, so I have uh, extracted all the files. Let's go over to our Subaru image processor. I'm happy to say that there was something actually in the images to look at and interesting over here. We'll get a look at the entire image in just one second. This one open. We can go right here. Rather than looking at my uh, notes, we can come right in here. There are the coordinates that were given to us. 4, 8, 8, 60, 56, 43. These are the uh, coordinates that were given to me uh, and 
the request to observe this object or hunt for this object um, and I have done that and I can only wonder now if uh, this object is what we're uh, expecting to be moving toward us or if there's something else in our view which will take another image in three days and get an opportunity to see if there's anything moving but I can show you here that this is the part of space that we're supposed to be in you can find out all the other information, the time, where the uh, telescope was that I used, the types of filter I used, etc., etc. to do is put the image on astrometry.net Now, because this object isn't directly in the center of our screen, that means that this object has a different coordinates than what the proponent of an unidentified celestial object said it would be. So we may still be looking in this general area in the future in three days to see if there's any movement but uh, we can find out probably what this object is right away by um, here, I'll upload an image into my astrometry.net account, we'll get a quick plate solve, and we'll discover what that object is, because it should tell us uh, right away, NGC, blah, 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 um, planetary nebula, nebula. Planetary nebula, depending on the color of that, which we're not getting a color result. But you can um, see what's going on here for my confirmation of uh, what we did see in that object or what we did see in that space. So that works, we can come back. It's our friend John's Palette Smart page. Go like John's Palette Smart. Go ahead and upload this photo. Well, I still have time.
come back success success NGC 1501, HD 25734, HD 25474. Here are the known objects in the image. You're seeing a lot of the uh, extra work that I will do to show everything that's going on here. So then I can shrink that, come back here. Okay, so I guess I should come back here and we can have a couple of, well, 20 seconds. This is where the object should be. This is what we have over here. Y'all have a great morning. I'm running out of time. Nine seconds left. <laughs>